<laughs> so, today I'm gonna show you how to make a sweet cordless light bar for your racing quad. Because the problem with these little racing quads is they are super fast. This is my little 210. This little thing does about 60 miles an hour. And sometimes when I hit a tree really fast, it disconnects the battery. So what do you do? How are you gonna find your quad if you can't, if your beeper won't go off because your battery's disconnected? This will require no wiring and about eight to nine dollars. So you can pick up one of these guys. They're a little thing that's designed to clip onto a dog's leash. So what I did is popped off the back because it has replaceable batteries. Pop this little guy out. And then all you have to do is pull out the little light. And then you have a cordless light system. Ooh. So what I did is, okay. I took a little piece of this silicone tube and then I punctured a hole through it, big enough for the light. And then once I did that, I cut it. So there's an up close shot of my light bar. As you can see, I just glued it to the bottom there. And then it has a little zip tie right there that goes crossways on there. So then you just gotta push it with your thumb. And then it lights up without any batteries. So this is a good fail safe to have. And it was only $8, and it looks sweet. Dead is. I got the disco one, so this one changes colors. Ooh. Or, if I push it twice, it'll flash red. Ooh. So I figured that's going to look really cool at night. And then I added a clear tube to it to make it a little wider. And then afterwards, I just glued in the ends with hot glue to like stop the light to make the bar brighter and it looks really cool and then this thing will run for about 20 hours before you have to replace the batteries and it's super easy or i had another idea i took one of my broken antennas and then i cut a ping pong ball in half and then i glued it around the top here and as you can see i drilled a little hole there check this out i'm gonna put this and then you can just put the light right in there and then it will make your antenna glow, which is pretty sweet. It looks really cool if you make it flash, ha <laughs> ha. And last, I got one of these Spider-Man lights for another battery disconnected headlight because I just don't like lights attached to my battery at the same time. I feel like it drains it and then it makes the throttle weird. So I like the cordless setup and then this one's super bright. And that's only three volts and it looks sweet. And it even has a low setting. Or we can make it strobe. Yeah, coming in! <laughs> so that was my quick how-to of make a cordless light system on your quad without adding a lot of weight or taking up any space. Hope you found this video helpful. If you liked it, leave a comment below. And then I'll do some more racing quad action stuff. It's totally sweet.